Well, hello there. It's Miss Renee from the library. It's been a while since I've done a story time, so you bear with me because you know how I get. I get off the subject. I get tongue-tied. I do all that weird stuff. But anyway, me and my friend here are here to read a book. What? He says I should not be wearing a hat. And why shouldn't I be wearing a hat? He said, hats are not for people or cats. Well, I like my hat. Why do they make hats for people if they're not for people? Hmm. That's a good question. But anyway, I'm going to do my story time anyhow. And I like my hat. But you know what? I might let you wear it for a little while. Oh, dogs do look cute with a hat on, don't they? Yeah, they do. But anyway, I'm going to sit you over there and you better be quiet through my story. It needs to be quiet so I can tell my story. You will be. Oh, he's a good dog. He really is. But I'm going to put him right over here. And I'm going to read a book that he likes. It says, Hats are not for cats. Well, let's just find out about this. Cats. Cats are not for cats. I just don't understand. And the book is by, oh, I didn't even tell you who the book was by. It's by Jacqueline K. Rayner. hope this is working and you're hearing what I'm saying. But anyway, the book is Hats Are Not For Cats and it's by a Jacqueline K. Rayner. And let's see who, who put the book out. Let's see. It doesn't say on the front. It doesn't say in the back. Huh. Here it is. Clarion Books put it out. And it's a good book. I bet they got bunches of books. So let's get started. Sorry, I'm not supposed to do that. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> okay, I catch my boy. Okay. I hope you can see my pictures good. This says, Excuse me, cat. I see you're wearing a hat. But hats are not for cats. Hats, you see, are for dogs like me. Hats are not for cats. My dog's over here laughing. Quit laughing. Not hats that are big or hats that are small. Hats are not for cats at all. Ooh. I don't know if I like that. I think everybody should wear a hat. Not pink hats or stripy hats or even polka dot hats. Dog wear, dogs wear hats and cats do not. Look what he did. Correct wearing of hats. He brought a dog with a hat and marked out the cat. Well, that's just something else. Okay, well, not hats that are festive or hats that are fun. Not hats for the cold or hats for the sun. Not hats that are fussy or hats that are frilly. Not hats that are serious. Ooh, that's a fireman's hat. That is a serious hat. Or hats that are silly. Look at that silly hat. It's made of fruit. I think I'd wear it because I'd eat the fruit. Not fine hats or flapper. Not dashing or dapper. Not pirate hats or party hats. Not odd hats or arty hats. Hmm. <coughs> Let's 
excuse me again. Not hats from Tasmania or hats from Transylvania. Not hats from Peru or ten buck two. Well, that'd be a long way to go to get a hat, ten buck two. Hmm. Hats are not for cats. Mm. This is some serious business here, isn't it? So, he drawed another picture again. Where he had the dog in the hat and the cat marked out. And it says, correct wear, wearing of hats, dogs, check mark, cats, X out. Hmm. Who does he think he is? Hats, yelled the cat, and go for his. R for cats, said the cat. Look at the hair. A bunch of cats showed up too. Oh, look, 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 look. Look at all the kitty cats in the hats. And they did a picture. They put frilly hats on the cats. Fun hats, flapper hats, frilly hats, silly hats, pirate hats, party hats, odd hats. Arty hats, hats for the cold, and hats for the sun, and every cat has a hat. I love that. <clears throat> but the dad, the dog, looks so sad. Look at him with no hat. He's so sad. The cat's wearing his hat. And the cat said, hats are for everyone. Oh, see, that was sweet. Now the dog's all happy. And look, they even took a picture of themselves with their hats on. That is cool. That was cool. I like that. Well, Miss Renee also has a, a little craft. If you want to have your parents or you have you... Uh, come by and pick it up it's at the front desk and it's a hat to decorate of your own i had a little friend she decorated this one for us i said oh i love the bling bling that would look really good on me oh look i could wear it this way or that way or i might even could try to wear it like that isn't that funny oh my goodness i do like a hat so you just tell your parents or whoever to come by and pick your craft up or have you with them or just however and just remember we're going to try to do this weekly so if you want a hat have somebody bring you by to get one to decorate we have all the little stuff in here to decorate we even have some little fuzzy balls and some stickers so it'd be fun to decorate your hat because everyone can wear a hat thank you come back and see us bye